Come on, John. Grandma's here. Why is Grandma here so early? We don't know. Oh, that's Grandma's. Two of them. Looks like you were right, Margaret. Good morning. Good morning. What's going on? Is everything okay? Oh, no. Oh, no is right. Ricky, don't you think it would be appropriate to tell your mothers when you decide to make a big decision like this? I mean, and your father. A big decision like what? Uh, like you two are cohabitating? Not us two. Us three. It's the three of us. Yeah, we decided that we didn't want to make any big announcement. Um, we didn't want it to be a big deal. Because it's not a big deal? Yeah. So if it's not such a big deal, why couldn't you just tell us that you three were living together? What she said. How did you find out? Same way I find everything out. People tell me things. Not people like you two, but other people. What people? We haven't told anyone. Oh, uh, actually, some of us have. Adrian told you? I don't disclose my sources. Just one of the reasons people are comfortable talking to me. And it doesn't matter who told me. I heard it from someone other than you. And that doesn't make me too happy. And let me tell you something. Your father isn't very happy about this either. In fact, he was going to come with us, but he had a surgery to perform this morning. You're not married to him. She's married to him. Shouldn't she tell me that? I'm telling you that. Has Ollie weighed in on this? How's your girlfriend or fiance or whatever she is? How does she feel about it? I haven't mentioned this to Ollie. I don't know how she's going to feel about it. I don't care how she feels about it. And as much as I love you both and my dad, I don't care how you feel about it either because this is what we want to do. So this is what we're doing. Uh, I care. Um, I care what you think. I also care what my dad thinks. And he's not too happy about it either. And I feel terrible about that. But I really love being here. I mean, I love Ricky. And we both love John. And um, we both love you. And we both have to get to school. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> Say bye, John. Bye, bye. Bye-bye. Bye, John. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye. Bye-bye. It just feels so healthy when we eat like that. The whole wheat pasta and that sauce. When we eat like that, I feel like we can have a dessert like this. Yeah, that sauce. What's in that sauce, exactly? It's a meat substitute. It's made from vegetables and soy products. I don't know how to cook with those things. I'll have to learn to cook healthier. Well, maybe I could cook that once a week. We can make every Friday night spaghetti night. Trying to get the taste of that sauce out of your mouth? Dad, stop teasing me. I know you like my spaghetti. You had a huge plateful. Maybe he wants to make every Friday night spaghetti night. Maybe you can come over every Friday night. I'll take Thursdays. <laughs> I'll see you too. <laughs> Thanks for coming over. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs>